So guys, in today's video, I want to share with you one of the most disturbing things that I have ever heard when it has come to childhood sexual abuse. It is a quick story of the time that I was seeing this guy. I was about 19 years old and he was the same age. I was in between relationships. At the time, I had what they call a baby father and we were on and off for a number of years. But in between that time on one of our off stages, I was seeing this guy and I felt comfortable enough to tell him a little bit about my background because he asked about my family. He didn't really see any family members around me. I told him that I had gone through sexual abuse. I told him that I didn't have my family around me really because, you know, we really didn't have a close relationship. And it was his comment to the fact that I told him about my childhood sexual abuse that I found quite disturbing. He said to me, when I told him that I had gone through sexual abuse as a child, he said to me that he had a couple of other ex-girlfriends that had gone through childhood sexual abuse. And he said he liked dealing with girls that had gone through childhood sexual abuse because they were more sexually open. After he said that to me, it made me feel quite dirty. I had a sense of shame about myself because I felt that I had let myself down by being intimate with this type of person and further validating his kind of theory about girls that had gone through sexual abuse. And I felt a sense of anger as well, you know, not just for me, but for his ex-girlfriends as well. Because for you to turn around and say that, you know, shows that you only care about your own needs. You're not caring about the fact that these girls, these ex-girlfriends of yours, had gone through something very traumatic. And it was something so disturbing to me at the time. And I was 19 at the time. And I'm 47 now. And I still remember it. I want to encourage you, if you are a guy or a girl who's dealing with somebody who has said something like this to you, I want to encourage you to cut this type of person out of your life. And maybe, even though they said that, and it's quite disturbing, at the end of the day, they're giving you the attention and warped kind of love that you think you need. They don't care about you. So I wanted to share that with you today, about this disturbing thing that I heard, because there are people out there that, in spite of your trauma and your vulnerability and your pain, will seek to use it to their own ends. Until the next video, take care.